so video watching is something i do but uh, i just need to have focused environment to be in like hello guys welcome back to my channel i am tanmay bhandari and i'm a third year mbbs student at bjmc today and in this video we are going to settle the debate about online versus offline classes for neat you guys must be thinking ki online classes mein apne aap ke comfort mein pajamas pen ke mast main apne lectures dekh sakta hu but this is only one of the perks of online classes but let's not forget the benefits of offline classes as well in this video we will be discussing the pros versus cons of online versus offline coaching i will be going to college and asking other people from my college to as to what mode of teaching they prefer and why so that we can get a complete breakdown and just mera view point nahi milega baki sare log se view point milne ke baad aur bhi things clear ho jayenge so without further ado let's begin when you are in a physical classroom you are more likely to stay focused and attentive and even if you get distracted apne aaju baaju ke logo ko फोकस देख के तुम्हारा फोकस अपने आप वापस क्लास में चले जाता है प्लस ऑफलाइन क्लासेस आर ग्रेट वे टू लर्न डिफिकल्ट कॉन्सेप्ट्स। अगर तुमको कोई कॉन्सेप्ट समझ में नहीं आ रहा है तुम वही के वही अपने टीचर को पूछ के तुम्हारा डाउट क्लियर कर सकते हो प्लस इफ बजट इज एन इश्यू ऑनलाइन क्लासेस आर वे चीपर ऑलमोस्ट फाइव टू टेन अमाउंट में तुम्हारा सेम सिलेबस कवर हो जाएगा प्लस ऑनलाइन में देर आर अ वराइटी ऑफ टीचर्स दैट यू कैन लर्न फ्रॉम तुम्हारे पास डिफरेंट डिफरेंट प्लेटफॉर्म होंगे प्लस यू कैन लर्न फ्रॉम YouTube and all. You can watch lectures at your own pace. अगर कोई easy concept है तो तुम उसको 2x एक्स में देख सकते हो फॉर दोज हु हैव अदर कमिटमेंट सच एज स्कूल और आर इंटरेस्टेड इन अदर एक्स्ट्रा करिकुलर एक्टिविटीज तुम तुम्हारे टाइम टेबल के अकॉर्डिंग यू कैन फिट इन योर ऑनलाइन क्लासेस वेर एज ऑफलाइन क्लासेस का एक फिक्स शेड्यूल होगा सो वो फिक्स शेड्यूल के अराउंड यू विल हैव टू बिल्ड अप योर एंटायर शेड्यूल लेट्स नॉट फर्गेट द सोशल एस्पेक्ट ऑफ लर्निंग अगर तुम एक क्लास रूम में बैठे हो यू आर सिटिंग विथ योर पीयर्स हु आर ऑल्सो प्रिपेयरिंग फॉर द सेम एग्जाम सिटिंग इन द सेम लेक्चर एंड गोइंग थ्रू द सेम थिंग्स दैट यू आर गोइंग सो दिस गिव्स यू एन ऑपरचुनिटी टू इंटरक्ट एंड बिल्ड सोशल रिलेशनशिप्स विच विल हेल्प यू विथ योर प्रेपरेशन ऑल्सो यू कैन पुश इच अदर एंड मोटिवेट इच अदर टू डू वेल सो दैट यू एंड योर फ्रेंड्स क्रैक नीड टूगेदर आई एम विथ माई जूनियर्स राइट नाउ मीत and i'm khadija so like these guys will tell you their marks and rank and in which year they gave me if they want i gave neat in 2020 and my score was 665 and rank was uh, 1700s mai tha kuch uh, i gave neat in 2020 and my score was 641 and my all india rank was 4400 khadija has been a teacher for many students at Ja, like she has a lot of experience with neat students and stuff in general. Let's start with. Uh, okay, so my opinion is definitely offline. Uh, having being on being an offline student as well as an online student, I can tell you. Uh, firstly, the very obvious point would be teacher and uh, student interaction. Just like when you are in the class and the teacher is right in front of you. uh that 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 gives a that gives more impact you know and then obviously uh the interaction is like more it's more comfortable with the teacher whereas in online if you see you're just sitting in your room and on your couch i don't know what in your blanket and then you're just you know ekdam uh, relaxed and lax your mind is somewhere else half the time and the video is just going on and on and on so there's a lot of difference in the attitude of students in offline and online yeah i just have a question what about day dreamers in online or uh, offline class ha day dreamers right but <laughs> being a teacher i'm not a teacher as such but having this you know thoda experience uh, in offline teaching i've taken a few lectures so teacher ko samne samajh jata hai if the guy is day dreaming now it, it's clearly visible on your face if they are actually uh, paying attention on each and every student they're going to pick you up so it's like day dreamers ka bhi sorted hai ha hota hai matlab mere se hua hai i have been day dreaming and i have been picked up and been asked to read something like that or ask questions so and uske sath matlab if you are giving test matlab ghar pe baith ke to kitna chahiye utna copy kar sakte ho tum log so for parents who are, who are thinking of joining like offline or online you are never sure ki your kid is giving the exam seriously but offline mein it's always like exam ka environment hota hai and you know that in final neat exam also you are going to be sitting like this only 
for exact three hours only at the same in the same environment. So offline giving test is also any time better than online. And plus in lectures also, I have learned maximum things by like asking doubts and interacting with teachers and like having a convo with them. I suppose hearing to lectures, I can't retain things for like two years and give need. So two way conversation basically. One way nahi hona chahiye. Ha, it should be always interactive. Two-way. Like lectures are always interactive. So as far as that is concerned, but one more point that I would like to add about test is like at after a certain point of time, tum tumare prep ke baare mein serious ho jaoge, and at that point of time, you can consider giving online tests. The reason that I'm telling you this is because like online tests. Happen on a national platform and वो test अगर तुम national platform पे दोगे so like you have a larger sample size or a larger amount of people that you can compare yourself to like obviously you need to get better on every test और हर एक test का तुमको like uh, suppose last time अगर मेरे को 600 हंड्रेड मिला तो नेक्स्ट टाइम सिक्स जीरो फाइव लाना है वॉट एवर आई जस्ट वॉन्ट टू कीप गेटिंग बेटर बट इन दी एंड वो लाइक इट इज नॉट जस्ट You know a self competition or like खुद के साथ competition नहीं है so complete competition है so like at certain points of time you should like give a test in which बहुत सारे लोग दे रहे हैं like not always but I think so yeah just you should be serious when you are giving tests online also like cheat मत करो यार it's bad for and mbbs college exams mein cheat kar sakte ga um also yeah so like in offline you have your friends around you right so it's it's or be aise like thoda environment acha hota hai but theek hai uh, doubt discussion and everything pehle you approach your friends right so that is one plus point whereas in online vc karoge raat ko and us pe discuss karoge that is really something i don't encourage at all क्योंकि उस पर फालतू बातें होती है एंड स्टफ बट सी इफ यूर ऑफ यूर सिटिंग यू नो विद ग्रुप ऑफ फ्रेंड्स एंड यू नो एवरी वन इज इक्वली मोटिवेटेड एंड यू नो दे हैव द सेम इंथ्यूजियाजम टूवर्ड सॉल्विंग अ पर्टिकुलर डाउट एंड सपोज सबका ही सेम डाउट है सो यू ऑल कैन अप्रोच अ टीचर टूगेदर समथिंग लाइक दैट सो फ्रेंड्स डू मेक अ लॉट ऑफ इम्पैक्ट दे डू एक्चुअली हेल्प यू अराउंड वॉट अबाउट टॉक्सिक फ्रेंड्स जो तुमको बताते हैं कि मैंने कुछ पढ़ा नहीं है और फिर बाद में पढ़ते बट या अगेन वो तुमको ऑनलाइन एंड ऑफलाइन दोनों में यू फाइंड टॉक्सिक फ्रेंड्स तो ऑनलाइन ज्यादा रहता है हमको तो दिखता भी नहीं है वो क्या कर रहे हैं फिर टेस्ट में रैंक आ जाता है वन टू फिर समझता है कि हाँ ये तो पढ़ के आया बस फिर सीरियसनेस भी मेंटेन हो जाती है लाइक लेक्चर में यू कैन डू एनी थिंग एल्स एक्सेप्ट फॉर फोकसिंग If you are in an online lecture, then आगे स्क्रीन चालू रहती है नीचे इंस्टाग्राम बाजू में मोमोज चटनी जो भी है सब टाइम पास एक साथ चालू रहता है तो यू आर नॉट फोकस्ड ऑन जस्ट स्टडिंग टाइम टेबल लाइक ऑनलाइन में लेक्चर लाइक सपोज अ लेक्चर इज पोस्टेड ऑन योर पोर्टल ओके एंड देन इट्स अपू यू वेन यू वॉच इट सो लाइक बैकलॉग का चांसेस आर रियली हाई Whereas if it's offline, you know you have to reach the class at a particular time. Be present there. You know you will get up early. You will do it. That's like you know a force on you. But online, my lethargy and everything, I totally understand. I am an online student, so I have the freedom. Ki jo jo parts I am confident with, or like who I can skip. और आई कैन जस्ट वॉच द लेक्चर्स दैट आई वॉन्ट टू वॉच जैसे कोई कोई कोचिंग क्लासेस में अटेंडेंस कंपलसरी कर देते हैं अगर मुझे कोई लेक्चर अटेंड नहीं करना है एंड अबाउट ऑल ऑफ दैट टू एक्स पे नहीं देख सकते ऑफलाइन ऐसे नहीं कर सकते सर टू एक्स ऐसा एक हाथ पॉइंट तो आई जाता है ना यार विच यू डोंट नो इवन इफ यूर हंड्रेड परसेंट श्योर विद द टॉपिक सो एंड दैट द टीचर इन ऑफलाइन ऑल्सो गिव्स यू सम टिप्स ना कि अभी सपोज इन ऑनलाइन आई एम स्किपिंग मैन लेक्चर बट एक्चुअली ही टोल्ड सम पॉइंट विच इज सम सॉर्ट ऑफ न्यू ट्रिक फॉर मी टू सॉल्व अ क्वेश्चन एंड आई माइट मिस इट ना सो उसका भी चांस बढ़ता इन माई यूजी प्रेपरेशन आई ऑलवेज बिलीव दैट अटेंडिंग अ लेक्चर इन रिस्पेक्ट ऑफ द फैक्ट वेदर आई नो द टॉपिक और नॉट इज नॉट गोइंग टू गिव यू एनी डिस पुट यू इन एनी डिसएडवांटेज इट इज ऑलवेज एडवांटेज लाइक ही सेड सम एक्स्ट्रा टिप्स समथिंग समथिंग 
so yeah so before we talk to more people from my college about online versus offline main tumko ye batana chahta hu ki agar tum koi offline class attend karte ho tum definitely youtube videos dekh sakte ho agar tumhare class mein wo concept acche se nahi padhaya gaya hai whereas agar tum online padhte ho aur even if offline bhi padh rahe ho You can use this app called Philo. इसमें अगर तुम्हारा कोई concept clear नहीं है you can just take a picture of the concept and वो picture तुम वहां पे upload करके 60 seconds में एक tutor से आपको connect करेंगे वो tutor आपको concept explain करेंगे and it will be a one-on-one study session. इससे क्या होगा कि तुम्हारे सारे concept crystal clear हो जाएंगे plus अगर तुमको वो tutor का teaching पसंद आ गया तो तुम उनको favorites में add कर सकते हो Plus, they have a lot of mock tests that you can attempt, and mock test is a real way to determine where you stand in your preparation with respect to NEET. So now it's time to interview my super juniors who have attended both online and offline coaching. So hi, I'm Simran, and uh, I'm from Jha, and I got uh, 6:35 out of 7:20 in me. Oh, uh, hi, I'm Sahil, uh, and I got 6:32 out of 7:20. I'm from Jha as well. So what is the cut off for BJ? Even I don't know, and people keep asking. Uh, the cut off. Last year for... it was six thirty yeah. for open, and this year it got I guess six hundred and seventy. Yeah. The yes. cut off reduced. Came down. Okay. Okay. Since you guys have attended both online or offline and offline, so now please tell me what what do you guys think? Um. So personally, I I found online uh better because first of all uh. I did not waste my time in traveling. Plus, um, I got extra time to cover up my uh, revision time, and uh, yeah, like because of uh, recorded videos by Jaswar and everyone, uh, I used to get to see the videos repeatedly. So my concepts got clear there by then. So these were the main advantages, and plus, um, I could rest at any time I want, and uh, so like there was a perfect balance between. Studying and uh, taking a rest and everything, so I personally found online better. So, guys, he is not like me. I am someone who would keep the video lecture on and just scroll on my phone. So, he is definitely not someone like me, and not like ninety percent of us. That is why he is in BJ. If Mera online classes hota, I would not have been in BJ. So, anyway. Okay, so I prefer personally offline more. because uh, now even right now i prefer coming to college rather than staying home and studying so basically it was because i i was a very distracted kid i used to get distracted many a lot of stuff like for phone tha then going down just chatting with someone so there were a lot of distractions i had and mainly getting out of my comfort zone was the main thing for me so i used to come to the class and study for a long hours and then go home and do whatever i wanted to also i got personal attention from a lot of faculty there so most of them knew me they used to solve my doubts on the spot whatever i wanted i got so that was another advantage i had for offline then the library and all of that was really helpful i was able to get in contact with the seniors over there who used to study or who used to just teach over there so they uh, gave me a lot of guidance on how to study and all so uh, and also video watching is something i do but uh, i just need to have a focused environment to be in like i need some people studying around me So that I am motivated to do that as well. So I cannot just sit at home and do something like that. So what do you think about like being in a focused environment and studying, or like it doesn't make a difference to you? Um. See, as long as you have the dedication to study, it doesn't matter where you study. So, um, I found my personal space as the best focus. Any tips for need need you? G yeah, motivation for need. For those who are preparing, just don't get lost in what you're doing. Keep. you know give appropriate time for your studies exercising and uh, you know health as well did you exercise when you were preparing yeah, for this every morning really yeah that is great um what i would like to say is uh, it's just a matter of two years and once in those two years you study once you enter college trust me it's a lot of fun you get to do everything and all the events and all up uh, you can participate in so just a matter of two years and you just have to stay focused for those two please years. once you enter into college don't stick to your books take part in as many events as possible take part in organizations events everything don't just be to your books all right and once you get into college or even before you get into college there's one thing that you can always do that is subscribe sorry <laughs> that was bad i'm going to cut it out <laughs>